This tech snip will go over how to test network latency to an Azure region. Let's get started. We're going to use a PowerShell module that I've created and published to the PowerShell gallery called AZ Speed Test. This module tests latency to Azure storage accounts that I've pre-provisioned in Azure. Let's go ahead and install this module from the PowerShell gallery. Now that that's installed, we can import it into our session. Okay, let's take a quick look at the commands available in this module. You can see we only have two commands in this module, get az region and test az region latency. If, if we run the get az region command, you can see we've returned the list of Azure regions around the globe. When we run the test az region latency command, we can pick one or more of these regions to test. Let's go ahead and perform a latency test to a few Azure regions. I'm going to test both the West US and East US regions and perform 25 test iterations to get a better representative sample. Now let's take a look at the results. Looks like my average latency to the West US region is 156 milliseconds and to the East US region it's about 400 milliseconds. If we need to access the raw test results, we can take a look at the raw results property. Let's take a look at the West US region. This information could be useful if you'd like to perform deeper analysis or store this information in a database. If you want to test all Azure regions globally, we can leave off the region parameter. Here, I'm going to perform a single test against all Azure regions. We can then sort this based on the average latency to find the fastest and slowest regions from my location. And that's how you can test network latency to Azure regions with PowerShell and the AZ speed test module.